This is the Kaczynski Cup, the most revered award in all of sports. And yes, it can be yours. If you're dedicated, if you go the extra mile, and if you brown nose just enough. Sitting atop the trophy is the official Grand Slam Baseball Camp logoed baseball with all the signatures of past winners and even those scorned whose names were ripped from the cup. Let's now review the past winners whose names are indelibly inked in Sharpie on the cup. 1993 Joe Trippi, former Washington Husky, who earned the victory through a story that only Bob Blair can tell. Coach Blair, a winner in 94, remains with our camp many years later. In 95, it was Jay Fox and Buddy Buck in a duel that has never been forgotten. Coach Fox still makes cameo appearances at Grand Slam camp. Moving on, Dave Walker, a legend in 1996, now a camp coordinator in Kitsap County. Dana McCracken, and then our first controversy. In 98, Dan Lloyd was selected. The Gonzaga Bulldog did everything except come back. He did not come back, and his name was stricken from the record, and Sean Harvey was put in his place. In the late 1990s and early part of this century, controversy struck the cup. As co-winners, Brian Murphy and Brendan Wood, both did not return in an unprecedented move. Anthony Slegel was put into his, their place as the winner in the year 2000. Things buoyed nicely moving forward when an all-time move occurred in 2001 and 2002. Kyle Baumgartner from the Kitsap County crew not only won the cup in 2001 but boldly claimed the Kaczynski Cup award on the website of the Central Washington Wildcat baseball team in his personal profile. An all-time move. Also in the late 1990s, controversy struck again. In 1999, Jay Powers shared the award with Mike Gersh. Powers, who is now a coordinator of camp in Pierce County, is still bitter to this day over this crushing blow. Cup winners from 03 through 05 were steady, sure, and could be counted on. Most notably, Nate Santiago, who even after graduation, here in 08, will be a member of the Grand Slam Camp crew. In 06 and 07, Grand Slam Camp expanded to three different locations per week, and the Cup took on greater significance to more coaches. But controversy followed the Cup, as consistency from some winners could not be found. Significant winners, Brady Van Hoof, still remains on staff. And from 19, or rather 2007, two of the winners will indeed find their name permanently on the cup as they have returned to the staff for 2008. However, and this could be difficult to watch, Nick Johnson did not return. And because of this, his name will now, for all to see, be stricken, stricken from the record, as only a Kaczynski name can be stricken. This was not pretty. But the Kaczynski Cup is pretty, pretty darn important. 
more important than the money you'll make, the friendships you'll gain, or any of the other positive experiences you'll have working for this camp. All of those things will come and go, but if your name's on the cup, it's there forever.